Today on Animal Fact Files, we're discussing bomber worms. These worms are annelids, or segmented worms, like leeches or earthworms, but they live deep in the ocean. They're elusive, but not rare. They live at least 8,850 feet below the ocean's surface, so they're not easy to reach. However, they're commonly spotted by vehicles cruising these depths. That being said, they weren't scientifically described until 2009. As of this recording, there are three named species of bomber worms, but this will likely change with new information. This just goes to show how much we don't know about what lurks beneath the ocean. Bomber worms are named for the eight bomb-like structures on their body made from modified gills. These regenerative bombs are released when the worm is threatened by other deep-sea creatures. The bombs glow when deployed and cause a distraction, like an octopus's ink. This gives the worm a chance to swim away. Bomber worms are separated from most other members of their family by their swimming ability. In fact, their scientific name, Swimma, is a reflection of this. It's believed these worms spend their entire lives suspended between 3 feet to over 1,300 feet above the floor of the ocean, meaning they are hollow pelagic. When they are inactive, bomber worms are neutrally buoyant, so they hang in the water, neither sinking or floating. Bomber worms are polychaetes, which are otherwise known as bristle worms. They get this common name from the fleshy protrusions from their body, called parapodia, that are covered in hair-like structures. An example of a bristle worm we've talked about on this show is the bobbit worm, or sand striker. Bomber worms swim using their parapodia. In one species, the bristles are flattened into paddle-like shapes. Their bodies are gelatinous and transparent, though in one species their gut is dark and stands out. Bomber worms reach over an inch in length and 5 millimeters in width. They have no eyes, but in the pitch black abyssal zone, they're not necessarily needed. Bomber worms have been observed off the west coast of North America, as well as waters around the Philippines. It's likely there are other places where they occur. It's just difficult to make these observations due to the remote nature of their habitat. In many ways, bomber worms are still a mystery animal. It's unknown how long they live, how they breed, or what they eat. For more facts on bomber worms, check out the links below. Give a thumbs up if you learned something new today. Thank you to our patrons, Spike Spiegel 93 Dad, and everyone else for their support of this channel. Thank you to these viewers for today's request. And thank you for watching Animal Fact Files.